You guys know what I hate? Infomercials. Like, they have really gotten out of freaking hand. All this bullshit they're putting on YouTube and Instagram and TikTok. That, oh, you know, the government is giving you $1,000 to pay all of your bills. All you need to do is click this link. And you click that fucking link and it takes you somewhere that annoys the shit out of you. And then they harass you. They cyber stalk the shit out of you. Email you six times a day. And please don't give them your phone number. Let me tell you guys something. Get a Google Voice number. Use Google Voice for everything. Every, 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 everything except for a major purchase. Because obviously, if it's a major purchase, you want them to be able to call you direct and not have any issues. Because I cannot tell you how many times I've changed my phone number because of some stalker or some bullshit like that. And then I can't get back into one of my apps because I used my old phone number. Now I got to start all over again. Anyway, back to the infomercials. This bullshit, let me read this shit to you. I'm sorry, maybe it's me. Maybe I'm a skeptic. But I really feel like, do you have to make me scroll on my phone for six hours reading testimonials and a bunch of videos before you even let me get to the product? Like, I can't stand that. I don't want all that fluff. I don't give a shit what... Mary's situation was I've researched your shit I looked up the ingredients I'm good with it can I buy the product now please but no they want to tell you about Mary and John and and Crystal who feels fat and this is what she did it's like you know build value build value I'm so tired of that in sales and then people get mad at you let me I'm, I'm gonna switch real quick because I've done sales you know, went to school for sales and marketing and I've done a lot of sales jobs and all these sales jobs, the bosses, your supervisors, they're all like, oh, you're not selling. You're not selling. No, fucker. People are not buying because maybe they're broke or maybe their dog just died or maybe they had to pay for a surgery or something important rather than this bullshit you're trying to push on them. You know, maybe that's the case. Same with these fucking infomercials. Anyway, back to the infomercial. All right. So she's like, her back flab and spare tire love handles, the veins and cellulite covering her butt and legs, the rolls of disgusting fat on her stomach, and her thick bulging neck. She constantly felt bloated, cramped, and constipated and gradually became consumed with feelings of shame, self-hate, and disgust. She hated the judgmental looks that others gave her when she ate, or how people only seemed to see her size. Okay, I'm not going to sit here and say that this does not happen, but really, are people really just at restaurants staring at fat people, watching them eat and getting disgusted, and showing their disgust? Now, I know that people kind of might side-eye, you know, At least they used to. But with this whole body shame movement, I really don't think anybody really does that anymore. I mean, maybe I'm wrong. But still, it's just a bunch of fucking stories and fluff. And you're like, okay, well, what if I'm not big and fat like this chick? Why am I reading this story? I'm not. So I don't, I mean, I'm not saying I don't care about big fat Ashley or whatever her name is. You know, if that's how she feels about herself and the product worked for her, great. I'm happy for you, Ashley. But can I just get to the product, please? Can you really just, you know, I'm scrolling still. Okay, y'all, I'm scrolling, 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 scrolling. More stories, more fat people in pictures, stories, fat people in pictures. (sighs) biggest loser picture blah 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 all this shit my thing is if your shit works do you really have to build all this value now you got a doctor in a lab coat which is basically stock photo it ain't no real fucking doctor and it's not the doctor who created this this miracle drug scrolling 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 still haven't got to the bottom yet to buy the actual product more testimonials science a lady in a picture with her love handles hanging over her jeans, blah, 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 more graphs, more charts, more big people in pictures, looking exhausted, trying to get on a treadmill, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, still haven't gotten to the bottom yet, guys. More graphs, more pictures, picture of a bottle. Okay, need I go on? I'm done. I'm done with this company. You won't get my money because it's taking you too long to just get me to the damn product.
thank you goodbye